can you feel the passion tonight? I was enjoying, like, I look like I was dancing a little. Alright, well, welcome back to another episode of Animal Acrossin. We're on day... I forgot. I've been stuck in this hell so long. Oh, hey, Table. What's up? Hey, Bobbit. How you doing, Table? I like the rain. Give me a job. Oh, darn, I'm sorry. Well, oh, I thought you'd have something nice to say to me. I love you, Tibbles. Oh, dear. Alright, mail time! Ooh, what we got? What we got? What we got? Got ourselves. Oh, nothing cool. Present. And present. And present. And I'll read that. We found a Triceratops torso! And we also found... Stego torso and... Dinosaur track. Well, I know what I'm selling. Alright, so today we're gonna go a little differently. I'm gonna fish a little. Find all the fish we can before we head to Tom Nooks. Ugh, oh, trees. Trees. Oh, hey, duck. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's try. I always enjoy being able to fish off of. Ooh, we can do something I really like. So just toss your thing in there. Oh, there. Arr, let's do a fish. Alright. So you just toss it in here, and it drops down. Alright? And then. Hey! Hey! What are you. What's right in front of you, you little jerk? Take the bait. Uh. Oh! It would look totally cool if I caught that fish being from up here. Ah, oh, it's probably something rare, too. I don't care. Oh, damn mosquito. Eh. I don't want to catch it. Sting me! Eat my flesh! Alright. Hmm. We're done with that. Now to show off to all of my avian friends. Watch my mad fishing skills, bros. Oh yeah. Oh, they are so proud of me. Thank you, Ducky. Buzz, you weren't clapping. I'm disappointed in you. No fish for you. Ducky gets all the fish. Oh, what sort of adventures have I had today? For the last few days, I guess I could say. Had some friends come back down from my where I used to live. That was pretty fun. We all got to hang out. I also got to convince them to take me to GameStop because there's no GameStop in walking distance of my university, which is really annoying. Got to go reserve my Wii a U. Pretty psyched about that. Actually, I'm really psyched for it. It's like, oh great, I have to wait two months until I can play it. Oh, so much time. You know what I want to see, though, is Animal Crossing in HD. Man, they could make this game look gorgeous. Okay, you know what, you stupid fish, I'm, I'm really disappointed in you, too. You and Buzz, you're on my disappointment list. Come on. That's a fish. Oh, ha ha yeah. Caught a cherry salmon. It looks so pitiful. You're a bad person, my Animal Crossing humor. That was some funny little video game uh, joking. Alright. So I was gonna say, right. The Wii U, they did their. Oh, fucking sure. Huh? They did their uh, press release yesterday. Told us all about the days which the Wii U is coming out. I went and got myself a. Uh, reserved a deluxe version of the Wii U. Ah. Oh. You can't hang on the edge, Fishy, you'll die. But, uh. Yeah, I'm pretty psyched. I don't know. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, yeah. Got myself a cruising cart. Um, so we had the black weed. That'll be pretty sweet. Ah, no more fish down there. How many fish I got? Need four more. But, uh, what was that? I was gonna say. Right. 
So I got the deluxe version that comes with Nintendo Land and all that, so I'm pretty happy about that. I also went in reserve. Music from our brothers, Wii U. Although, the problem is, is that there's so many good games actually coming out for the Wii U on the first day. You got Zombie U, which is, oh man, that game looks so amazing. Unfortunately, I do not have that much money. In fact, I do not have the money for a Wii U yet. Hoping after I, you know, get my new tablet and get some more commission nights done and work a little faster and get some more cash in to be able to actually afford my Wii U. It looks like I'll probably have to hold off for a while until I can get more games for it. Because see, also, they got like Paper Mario and Presser Lightning else coming out next month, which is really annoying. It's like all the good games are coming out. Well, not next month, they're coming out in November also. Man, that's just a pain in the butt. Why do they got so many good things coming out all at once? Uh, where are we at? Oh, we need two more. Welcome to Robert Plays Bass Fishing. Base Bass. How many basses will I catch? The answer is not that many. Rainbow trout. Now that's a trout of a different color. Alright. Who's next? What's the final fish? It's pitiful. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We got something with soulless eyes. Solus. Speaking of Solus, let's go say hi to Tom Nook. So I got junk for him. Ooh, pineapple bed. Pineapples are cool. I'd like to sell everything. All right. I so was actually one of the bigger surprises at that press conference yesterday was the fact that you know. Bayonetta 2 is coming to the Wii U, and I'm actually, I really liked the first one, and I can't wait to actually get to play on the Wii U. I was kind of surprised that uh, Nintendo got it, but when we think about it, Nintendo actually is the one who's been, uh, they're publishing their, oh god, that's a bad price for printer to say. Uh, they're publishing, uh, what is it? Uh, the Wonderful here, uh, the Wonderful 101. And I think Konami's the only other people who are actually publishing stuff for uh, Platinum Games. So I'm not really surprised that uh, Nintendo went and bought out for Bayonetta. <clears throat> well, the real question should be asked, because there's a lot of angry people who are really upset about Bayonetta being a Wii U exclusive. But the real question should be asked is like, not why did Nintendo get put, why did Microsoft and you know, Sony didn't actually jump up for it. Now, I think there's actually a pretty, like, actual reasonable reason for why that is. And it more has to do with, uh, I don't think, if I remember correctly, Bayonetta wasn't actually, like, a big hit when it first came out, but it was a slow burner. So, like, the longer it's out, the more people, you know, got into it and bought it, and... And even though that is a good market thing, so you do sell a lot of games in the end, I think it was, like, 2 million units they sold. The problem is, is that in our economic times, people don't want to wait to get their profit, they want their profit to be instant, that's why, you know, like, Call of Duty, and New Super Mario Bros. Oh, we have to do four, hoo hoo. Uh, is there anything else I want? What's, what we got over here? I would like to see it. Oh, crap, that's fancy, Tom. It's a bit too fancy for me to like, though. And, uh, I can't help but think that, you know, It's kind of annoying for a, uh, you know, if you're a semi-big company trying to actually, like, oh, I should have sold stuff, oh well. You know, trying to, uh, blah, 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 blah. make a game, but it's not a popular game. It's really hard in this, uh, you know, I should say, cli economic climate, where no one really wants to take any risk or anything, because in truth, who knows how well a sequel of Bayonetta actually would sell. I mean, it's still pretty well because they actually developed a rather large fan base, but the same can be said of many games that have large fan bases and then don't sell well. Because the fan base isn't really large enough. But hey, you know what? I'm just happy we're getting another Bayonetta. And I don't mind that Nintendo's actually floating the bill because then you actually get another Bayonetta. 
Although my friend did bring up actually a pretty good point. The director for the first bit. Oh, that's a new villager. Oh dear, he looks a little too happy. How's it going, Boots? Um, so one of the things is that, uh, I think his name's Hideki, uh, the director for, uh, the first Bayonetta. Uh, he's no longer the director for the new one. He is the supervisor. Which, my friends, you know, say, it's, that's not director, and, you know, when you're not the director, you actually get to have all your full saves or anything. But he is the supervisor for the game, so... You know, I, I, I believe Superfast is a good enough role for someone also, but uh, my friend is saying, be a little wary, you know? Even though he does supposedly have the spot, you know, take it with a grain of salt, because he might not actually be helping out as much as he was originally. But the new director I have faith in, my friend doesn't, because he's actually kind of a new guy. He was the original art director for the first game. Yeah, I, I believe artists could be good game directors, you know? I, I think I could be a good game director. But, uh, that's be interesting to see how well that goes. Yeah, it's actually kind of a bet between my friend and I, because it's all like, you know... Oh, Green Pantry. Uh, my friend and I are... We're both, we're gonna buy it, because he loves it. I like to play it also, and... I have a Wii U, we're actually... He's, he's not a very, uh, pro Wii U guy yet, but... He likes a lot of the games for it, even though he's all like, Oh, I don't want a Wii U. Yeah, I like Pikmin 3, but I don't want Wii U. I like Bayonetta too, but I don't like Wii U. It's this weird stigmatism Nintendo's got now. But hey, you do what you gotta survive, right? That's the way of capitalism. And Nintendo's carrying that Bayonetta 2 is gonna definitely spur some sort of sales. Well, speaking of other games I really want to be, I'm really interested in Rayman Legends. Oh, that one looks like it uses the gamepad really well. And uh, Zombie U, man. That's two Ubisoft games I really want. Um, is there any other Wii U games are kind of staring like, oh, right, well, I mean, it's Pikmin 3, and New Super Mario is Wii U, but I've already got those on pre -oda. Um, There's Nintendo Land. I actually am really interested in Nintendo Land, even if it is essentially, well, it is what it is. It's a Wii Sports basically sort of thing, except not as boring as Wii Sports with just a bunch of sports. I mean, personally, I think it's actually a really good way to for people like me, Nintendo fans, to show off to people what the Wii U can actually do. And it does what Nintendo always does. It makes simple, multi local, local, keep in mind, local, beyond belief, multiplayer. And you know who likes simple local multiplayer besides simple-minded people like me? That's children. And that's basically Nintendo's main market normally. I mean... I'm an adult. There's a lot of Nintendo fans who are adults who actually really enjoy Bandai too, also. But, you know, you gotta keep in mind that Nintendo really is, at heart, a children's company. Even though I don't like saying that, but, you know, it's the truth. You know what? Whatever keeps your company afloat, and I get more Nintendo games, because I'm okay with that. Because I like getting more Nintendo games. Uh, oh, Booker, you failed me. Sup, copper? Right, we're playing Animal Crossing and not Wii U games, even though I want Wii U games. Oh, what's going on today? It's raining. There's Rasher. Yep. How you doing, swine? Is that right? Good, good. But if you work too hard, you're buying my chest shut down for the one day. Sure, laugh it up, Juggles. Those of you laughing when you get soaked and catch a cold, swine. So then, swine, why are you here? Do you a favor? Uh-oh. Man, he's a... grump. I'll handle it, Rasha. Let's see, Freckles. She's a duck. She's over by the river. So let's go over there. Let's go see what... Fabra is at. Oh, dick spot. Fabra, it's because you're a bitch. That's why you don't see me. I don't talk to you. I need to work. Oh, dear, she's been waiting for me. Oh no, more clothes. I forget to think that Tibble's a bit of a fashion king. Him changing clothes all the time. Man, I wish I could have a scarf in this game. I keep on talking about, like, other games, because that, that just reminded me about, you know, how Animal Crossing jumping out is coming out in, uh, 
January. I'm thinking about trying to make some Animal Crossing badges also for further confusion. That'd be pretty fun. Where am I? Oh, there I am. It's like, which village am I in? Is this my village? Ooh. Oh wait, I already got the Mega Rock today. What am I doing? I've got a pill bug. That's a better pill for you to swallow. Uh -huh. All right, table so, up. Oh, hey, Alphonse. Hey, Rex. Wow, both my lazy villagers are in the same spot. Ah, oh, no, Rex. I'm sorry. Let me help. Oh no. All of my animals want mail, but whenever I send them mail, it, they tell me that I cannot function, cannot function in society as someone who writes mail. Well, you ran far, Alphonse. You just said the exact same thing as Rex. Give me a job. Sorry, Alphonse. I'll be there for you when the, the something starts to fall. Fossils start to fall, that is. Oh, uh, let's see. Soccer ball, prepare to meet your doom. Oops. <laughs> Alright. I believe it is time. It is time for me to... Deposit. Oh, yeah. We are done once again. No problem, Pelly. Hey, we gotta go. Th oh, wait, no, I think I got mail in my room. I need to go grab some mail and send some of these stuff up. Oh, by the way, I freaking love this song. I don't think I've heard this again in another Animal Crossing game, like, not like this. I'm just gonna give us a, a few seconds to listen to it. Just so happy, so full of life, and I'm completely debt free. That ball respawned and changed balls. How unusual. Oh! Ooh, we got space. There you go. Oh, and I need space for mail. Crap! Gotta, gotta grab the mail. Man, I wish it was raining in real life though. Oh, Tibble. Wait. Here. I got crap for you, Tibble. Now, I'll just strip that shirt off in front of me. Oh, you're an eight now. No, you're not paying, Tibble. You're amazing. Oh, I have your number two shirt now. Why, thank you, Tibble. You're so nice. Your shirt probably smells fantastic. Good. Uh, let's see what else in here. Right. We're gonna drop off the tater tots. Oh man, I better sell those tomorrow, else I'm not getting any profit off of those. Alright, we want to take out some mail. Oh. So I don't have any mail. Hmm. Oh, what did I pick up from the, the junkyard? I should probably look. Um, pineapple bed? No. Green pantry? No. Table tennis and a melon chair. Uh, let's see, what do we got in here? I believe. No, I like that chair. Melon chair is hella gay. Uh, I like my umbrella. What's table tennis look like? Oh, I love tennis. Oh, that's, that's so cool. It'd be cool if they could like make a little mini game inside the game for like a lot of the stuff you pick up. Like a little simple like uh, billiards game to get a billiards table or table tennis for you know the table tennis table. That'd be really cool. These my ideas, Nintendo. Take them. Although one idea that I really liked that I thought about was uh, watching the Animal Crossing movie. They have a lot of environments and it's like you know like a kind of a big adventure sort of thing. It'd be kind of cool if there's a cave. Air oh, there's freckles. A cave area in Animal Crossing for you to go exploring and all that. Or what I think would be actually kind of even near, which would encourage you to go to other villages. 
is if each village was more unique, like being its own climate, and had, you know, like, specific things going to the area, like the caves, or a forest, and, uh... But the thing would be that, to make this work, though, you have to be able to visit random people to be able to get, like, new access to new village areas. Or, uh, all your friends list, you should be able to go to their villages. And to do this properly, they have to be connected to the internet all the time. So I would say that the new, if my beautiful envisioning of the Wii U Animal Crossing, it would have to be a online-only game. And Nintendo would have a connection about that and go and cry in the corner. But I think it would make a fantastic environment. Oh, right, I paid off. I've always been satisfied with my house, Tom Nook. You gotta build me a second floor? I want basement. Alright. Uh oh. Oh, he has a basement, eh? What's in your basement? Alright, let's grab some maple leaf paper. Yes, I would. Thank you, Tom Nook. I love your paper. Oh god, get your nose out of my eye. Oh god, this is painful. Stop wiggling in there. Uh, oh. Soda machine? Did I have another soda machine? Did I pick up my soda machine from my house? I don't think I did. I don't want that shirt. That bug can go. Alright. I'm rich, biatch! Uh, I guess I'll try mailing my <laughs> rainy day paper. That's quite appropriate. I guess I'll try mailing uh, my villagers after I finish the video because you guys don't want to sit me watch me here going, Well, how are you, my dear animal friend? Just don't think that would be too entertaining for anyone to watch. It's pretty dark tonight. Oh, actual news. I should talk about actual news. I mean, um... Uh... Start up the auction again. That's pretty good. As in I can actually, you know... Go back to trying to earn that money. We're up to $400, so that's pretty good. Uh, that means I have about... 300... At this point, I have about 350 to, uh... Earn on my own. I think I have about 100 bucks right now, so... Oh, alright, keep that for later. But, uh, 100 bucks to, uh... Sell... Sell. I don't want to sell 100 bucks, that'd be a fool. No, I want to, uh... To be able to buy... I have 100 bucks to put towards my... Thing. Tablet. Cintiq. The thing I really want but cannot remember anymore because I have suffered from the stupid. So... That means I have to earn about 250 bucks on my own. It's because I have to start doing some more streams. Maybe I'll do one tomorrow. That'd be kind of fun. Although by the time you guys get this, it'll, it'll be like two days after tomorrow. And you guys will be like, why don't you do one on Wednesday? Oh, I need to, f oh, I just remember, I need to, like, find this one commissioner. I, like, have a sketch of this thing. I haven't actually shown it to him. Crap. Uh. I have to admit, I have a very poor system of, uh, putting all my commissions together. I probably should work on that. That'll be my nearest resolution. Oh, I don't got anything in the mail. All right, Pally, we are done. It was nice talking to you. And especially nice of you, my, my loyal, loyal viewers, to be here with me. And to say to my loyal viewers, I wish you all a good night.